OTP is a way to securely sign into your portal by entering the random codes generated by your predetermined authenticator app. If your organization allows you to use Oath OTP to prove your identity when signing into the portal and allows you to set up your own code generator, you will need to set it up before you can use it. First, you will want to install an Authenticator app on your device, like Google Authenticator or 2FA Authenticator. Once installed, open the app on your device. Back in a browser on your computer, sign into your portal. You can set up Oath OTP by selecting the prompt if you see one similar to this. Or you can also go to the Account tab to get started. Your organization configures the type and name of the Oath OTP option. Ours is called Oath OTP Client in this example. We select Show QR Code. On the device, we open the Authenticator app. The apps vary, but for this one, we select Get Started and tap Scan a QR Code. Once we've scanned the QR code, a six-digit code appears. We will enter that code in the code field and select Verify to finish the configuration. Note that the six-digit code is time-based. A new code is generated about every 30 seconds. If you don't get the code entered and validated before a new code appears, you will need to delete your code and enter the new one. Once the code has been verified, you will be able to use future codes as a way to prove your identity when signing into the portal. While you are logged in, you may want to set up more than one factor to give yourself as many options as your organization allows for proving your identity. Oath OTP is an easy way to securely access your portal in the future. Make sure to check out the videos on signing in.